On the hop! Let's go! Let's go! Power! Hurry up! Hurry up! Let's go, female! Hurry up! Hurry up! Let's go! Move faster, you! Night of Arrival was just... Get off the bus and get in the building! Move! Move! Move faster, you! Move! I'm like, what did I get myself into? So it's like one second we're on the bus, watching the little video, trying not to fall asleep. And then as soon as we get off the bus, like it's immediate screaming. Let's go! Move! Move! Move faster, you! Um, I remember getting yelled at. That's pretty much all I can remember is just getting yelled at. Move! Move! Make two even rolls! Move! Move! Let's go! Move down! Let's go! No! Down! No! Down! Good afternoon, I'm Chief Petty Officer Jamie Kala. I'm a recruit division commander. The minute you get off the bus, there's going to be a lot of stress applied upon you. The yelling, the go, 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 can you do this, can you get that done? Um, you know, and it's up to you to basically perform under pressure. Look straight! Look straight! Welcome to the United States Navy. For the next eight weeks, you will not do a single thing on your own. I tell you what to do, how to do it, when to do it. Nothing that I ever tell you is a request an option or a suggestion. So you, you, will you, do it. you make it, you give you a direction and you have 0.5 seconds with. to pay attention to it, to the letter. So you, you can't mess up. If you mess up, then that's on you and it's really gonna fall back then on you. You will roll up your pant legs three inches up. When you are done, you will be on the tall line, standing straight, looking straight, awaiting further instruction. You have 15 seconds. Go, go, oh, hurry up, let's go. Go. Let's hurry go. up, let's go. I said, behind you, behind you, not next to you. Is that touching your heels? No, it's not. Fix it. Pull Fix your off. Fix Pull it. Off. He said, get down to the last shirt with sleeves. Maybe I wasn't loud enough. Maybe you couldn't understand me. Fix yourself now. I thought it was going to be uh, a little bit more relaxed, but definitely isn't. A lot more intense than I did think it was going to be. Who said to stand like that? You must love getting special attention. Huh? No, Chief. Get that attention! Now! I'm pretty sure that I said your hands will never be behind you. Your hands will never be in front of you. What is your problem? Medium. Medium. Proper military bearing will be maintained 24-7 and it starts tonight. Do you understand me? Yes, Chief. I can't hear you. Do you understand yes, me? Yes, Chief! Yeah, that was the hardest for me. Just to, like, not even argue the point. Just take it, you yeah. This row's gonna fall out and then that row. Let's go. Let's go fall out. Move out faster. Let's go. Get over here. Lost in the sauce. Let's go. Let's go. Hurry up. Hurry up. Get down there. Look down. Get in back. Get in back. Get in back. Sorry. You grab that. You hold me. We got our sea bag, which was the big green duffel bag that you have to carry. You take all of your personal items off, like all of your clothing, your shoes, everything you arrived in. You put it in a box, including your cell phone, and ship it home. And then you get brand new everything from t-shirts that we're wearing to the PT clothes, the sneakers, nothing that you came with aside from maybe a hairbrush and a few personal items gets to stay with you. I knew that I would have to carry my own luggage, like there was no bellman service here, but I didn't expect all of my things to be that heavy. Like when I was filling it up, I was like, okay, great. This is so convenient. Everything fits in this little green bag. Wonderful. And then I had to put it on and it wasn't so wonderful. Anymore. Okay, then fix it now. Uh, I've been up since three in the morning since last night. And I don't know how I am awake right now at this moment. And I've been on my feet and my feet are dying. So that's it, I'm exhausted, my arms feel like they're gonna fall off, and it's not fun yet. I don't even know, 
I, I didn't even I, sleep at mix. Yeah, I nearly, I nearly fell asleep standing. So. I am naturally standing out of tension right now. I'm not even trying to, but... <laughs> it's, it's definitely getting a lot tougher for recruits. Pretty sure I said you will sound off. Yes, Chief. Huh? Yes, Chief. Did I say walk back on the tow line? I didn't. Do you know where you're at? Respond! Say something! Yes, Chief. No, Chief. Maybe, Chief. What is it? Yes, Chief. Because responding is not an option. From what other people would say, and like how they said that they've kind of they've got a bit softer because of um, like the era that we're in, but no, I think it's still kind of the same. There is a reason for everything that we do here. We do instill that pressure. So what is it doing next to you, huh? Let me guess, you want, ah, no, no! Now you want to fix it. Maybe had you just done the right thing the first time, you wouldn't be in this situation. Uh, because again, when, when you do get to the fleet, we want to make sure that you, you fight and you don't fold. It's nothing like boot camp. It's nothing like Navy boot camp. You are joining the United States Navy. I, I expected it to be hard. No. I'm not a sir! No chief. I'm not a chief! No sir, no. no, no. 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 I tell them all the time, this is more your Navy than it is mine. You know, years from now, I'm going to retire and you're going to take over my spot. And I let them know that I want to make sure I can tell my wife and kid that we're safe at night because there's tough people in the Navy and I know for sure because I put them in. But we're gonna be going down the speedway and cause and fouls from the left. Means the left front is gonna take off first. Everybody will go down the speedway in a single foul line. So on, do you understand that? Yes, yes. You have to get a little louder than that for me. Yes, yes, sir. All right, so cause the fouls from the left. Last recruit, sound off. Last recruit, fall out. Stand by. There, once we receive them, we put them in divisions. So we assign them uh, to the divisions as we need them. And then around 0330 in the morning, once everybody goes through that entire process, then the in-processing barracks team picks them up and takes them to Chow. And from there, you know, later on, that, later on a few hours from there, they'll meet their recruit division. Let's go, hurry up. To per bunk. Standard for the bunk picture. Yeah, I just want to get boot camp finished. <laughs> I like challenges and I feel like this is a challenge and I'm gonna beat it. I'm gonna I'm gonna graduate without doubt. It's going to happen. I have a very set goal of what I'm here to do. If I have to get yelled at, I'm getting yelled at, and that's fine. But in eight weeks, I plan on being out of here. So I don't have time to fight with anyone or to get in any type of trouble or get set back because that's not what I'm here for. Just in and out and move on. Just get out of here. Yeah, just get out of here. I want to graduate. Um, like I thought it just comes with going to boot camp that you were going to graduate, but you have to earn it. So. Yeah, it's definitely harder than I thought it was. Oh, no.